Good morning, everybody. It's Tracy. And today, I have some cards to share with you. Now, these cards, I most of them I've done over the last few weeks. And I just haven't shared them. So before I put them away, I figured I would let you see what I did. Okay, so first of all, I did this one. I used my Cricut for this card. I used the Create a Critter Cricut cartridge. And this cartridge I got basically my daughter convinced me to get this because she thought the animals were just super cute. And she's right. I really like this cartridge, but I still think that she's going to get more use out of it than I will. So yeah, I use a creator cricker, bleh, creator cricker, create a critter <laughs> cartridge. And what I did is I used uh, an older bow bunny collection called uh, Petal Pushers for the uh, background. And this is like a cutout. And the water is from the cartridge and little um, hippopotamus and hip hip hooray. And then I used another part of the paper inside. Simple card. But cute. Love the colors. And that's a 6x6 six six card. Okay. And then I made this card. And this card I used, <clears throat> I believe it's the Sweet Threads collection, yeah, by, um, uh, Gray, uh, Basic Gray, this is the collection. Sweet Threads by Basic Gray. And I colored the little girl, I think her name is Piper, I believe, and... Use the EK Success Punch to punch out that stamp that I stamped. I have some um, ribbon and some pom pom trim on the bottom. And then here I use my So Easy to stitch that part right there. And then you open it, and that's what it looks like inside. Okay. Oh, and I also paper pieced her hat because I don't think that I could do that <laughs> without paper piecing. Okay, so the next card I did is this one. And this little girl I know is called Sweet Anya. She's one of my favorite greeting farm stamps. And for this card, I use the Bow Bunny. Um, what is this called? Vicky B collection. That's what it looks like. And I use Nestabilities for the uh, frame. And I have some um, Recollections flowers. And I Am Rose's leaves. Put some ribbon down there. Stamped that sentiment and punched it out with a um, punch. EK Success Punch. And I put some stickles on the flowers to make them shine a little more. And, and that's the inside. Okay. Alright, so on to the cards that I actually made yesterday. And I made this one yesterday, and this is an A2 a size card. The other cards were all square, either 6 inches or 5 and a half inches. This one is just a plain A2. And I used Nestabilities to cut out her little uh, frame. And um, for this card, I used the Harvest Gathering mat stack that I got from Joann's few weeks ago and the little girl is from uh, the greeting farms it, the set is called I I think I heart sweaters or something like that I don't know 
something like that. And so I just used the paper to mat, put some ribbon down here, some Prima leaves, fall leaves, along with um, Recollections flowers, and this little brad is a Recollections brad from uh, an autumn collection a few years back. Okay, so that's the front, and then that's the inside. Okay, and the last card I made using the Ghosts and Goblins Mad Stack. And this little girl is Tilda by the greeting, no, by Magnolia. And um, so I just colored her, used Nestabilities again. Martha Stewart punch here and you know what actually I did not use that stack I just showed you Ghosts and Goblins matte stack sorry wrong stack what I did use is this big stack the Halloween and fall stack of paper so anyway so this is the card and a note to say, and ta-da, it's a pop-up, a pop-up card. I'm so excited. My punch, I ordered this punch, not punch, but um, die right here. And it's called, uh-oh, I put it in wrong, so what is this thing called? Okay, no. Zigzag 3D pop-up. And that's what this is called. And um, I saw a video during Cha by Sizzix that um, Karen Bernstein did. And I fell in love with this. So I ordered it and it finally came yesterday. And I had to make a little pop-up card. Now this is my very first pop-up card. So it's very imperfect. Not perfect at all. But I will get better. And but so far this this is what I have. So see once again that's the front and then you open it. And it says happy Halloween. I really, really love it. It's so much fun. And I can't wait to do more of these. <sighs> yeah. So those are my cards. And that's it. I need to uh, do some other projects, I guess. <laughs> but anyway, thank you all for watching and have a great day. Bye-bye.